We're going to be using S-Tools today to demonstrate steganography. Uh, S-Tools is sh short for steganography tools and it brings you the capability of concealing files within various forms of data. Now the key to most applications of steganography is uh, digital data uh, such as scanned images or sampled sound files. Um, generally we think of computer data as having to be a hundred percent accurate in order for it to function correctly but digital sample data such as images and sound files uh, don't need to be a hundred percent accurate and so what that allows us to do is make subtle changes to the sample data and we can conceal information um, while containing um, our uh, while retaining the uh, content of the original sample. Uh, S-Tools uh, can encrypt the uh, hidden file and uh, we'll see that in our little demo here. I'm going to drag an image over to S-Tools. I'll expand it so you can see the image a little bit better. And you can see down here in the corner here it uh, is indicating to me that um, this particular image can hold um, about 107 kilobytes of uh, hidden data and what we'll do next I've already prepared a uh, document I just used notepad to create a little note uh, and I'll drag that over to the image drop it in place it's telling me that it's uh, going to hide a file that's about 188 bytes. So there's plenty of room for more stuff to be hidden if I wanted to. But And I'll type in my passphrase. I'll type in steg here. Make up whatever passphrase I want. There is choices for different uh, encryption algorithms, but I'll just use the IDEA algorithm here click OK and my uh, data is hidden in the uh, in the file next we'll uh, save the uh, file with its hidden data so do right click and I'll do save as let me find the folder that I want to put that in put it in my S tools demo you can say I already have one version of it in there which is the original version that I use but I'll call it truck beer 2 and click save Now we're going to assume that you have uh, emailed the image uh, to a friend and uh, that you want to communicate with and you've given them some advanced information as to what to do with the image including the, uh, the password. So they would uh, receive the image, uh, open up S tools, drag the image into uh, S tools do a right click on the image and click on reveal type in the passphrase that you had communicated to them somehow click OK and it reveals the uh, document that I hid notice 114 uh, meetme.txt is the name of of the document so next what they would do is do a right click on the document uh, title and click save as and I put a folder inside my S tools demo to uh, 
hold it so that way I don't have to replace my original and I'll click save and I've saved that now and I'll open up S tools demo and find the refield uh, fold folder and here's my meetme.txt I'm gonna open it up with notepad and here is my hidden message that I sent to my friend Chong, meet me at 101 University Avenue. I'll bring the stuff. You bring the buyer Saturday, 10:15 p.m. Signed, Cheech. That concludes our demonstration of using uh, S tools for steganography, and I hope you learned something about steganography in the process.